When we talk about the number of complex tasks that one robot can perform, we'll be truly surprised by the number of utilities the Tesla bot can provide as upgrades happen daily. We bet that Elon Musk will pursue this project when he just made a major announcement that could potentially lead to Tesla before officially selling them. That's what we'll dive into in today's episode. And welcome to Techno Creators. Before we begin, please help us reach 3,000 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great tech episodes. How will Tesla Optimus perform their task? In recent updates from Tesla, Optimus has been demonstrated performing basic household tasks such as watering plants, picking up packages, cleaning the kitchen, and carrying items from the car trunk into the house. Tesla describes Optimus as a companion designed to assist safely with a wide range of domestic activities, from childcare to supporting elderly individuals. Currently, Optimus can hold natural conversations, offering companionship for seniors and answering questions from children. These capabilities emphasize Optimus's potential to seamlessly integrate into daily life, proving it is much more than a purposeless machine. Beyond the variety of tasks it can perform, most people are more concerned with how safely Optimus executes these tasks. For instance, how can the robot maintain cleanliness while working? Imagine taking out the trash and then preparing a sandwich. Humans can wash their hands, but can the robot do the same? This question is challenging to answer, as we're not Tesla bot engineers. However, what we do know is that Optimus has exceptionally advanced hands, often regarded as the best robotic hands in the world. This isn't just about their 22 degrees of freedom compared to the 27 degrees in human hands, but also about their innovative design. According to Elon Musk, these hands operate using tendons, much like human hands, and are built with fewer moving parts that might be damaged by water. The materials used are also easy to clean with water and soap, and may even have antibacterial properties. Given these design elements, a solution to such challenges seems likely. Additionally, it's worth noting that Tesla has confirmed that Optimus's hands represent half of the robot's technical development effort. A humanoid robot wouldn't be practical if every action had to be manually programmed. This means that purchasing an Optimus wouldn't require training it from scratch, which would otherwise be a time-consuming process, right? It can watch a video of something like a person and and then learn just by looking at that video and, and do that task. While traditional AI models require vast amounts of data for training, the Tesla bot doesn't rely on this approach. Instead, it can learn by observing examples. If you demonstrate enough instances of a task, the robot can generalize and perform tasks it hasn't been explicitly trained to do. As Elon Musk explained, you simply need to show it a video, and Optimus will be able to replicate the task. According to Elon Musk's vision, you only need to provide simple instructions to the Tesla bot, demonstrate what needs to be done, or simply describe the task, and the robot will autonomously figure out how to solve the problem. One of Optimus's most remarkable features is its ability to interpret human body language. It can understand human intent by recognizing gestures, such as pointing or signaling. This capability enhances interaction by reducing the need for verbal communication. For individuals who have difficulty speaking, gestures alone are sufficient to convey requests to the Tesla bot. Recent advancements in AI have empowered robots with extraordinary capabilities in just a few years. Creative AI is the cornerstone of what humanoid robots can achieve, allowing them to bridge the gap between artificial intelligence and real-world functionality. It's like using ChatGPT. It can generate a recipe but can't cook the meal for you. With Optimus, however, that dynamic changes entirely. Owning an Optimus means having a robot that can turn instructions into actions, bringing AI-driven solutions directly into your daily life. You need to be the best in real-world AI, and Tesla's the best in real-world AI. Elon Musk highlights that the key distinction between the Tesla bot and other humanoid robots lies in its brain, the advanced artificial intelligence powering the robot. Tesla, a leader in practical AI, has developed a brain capable of controlling a self-driving car, essentially a robot on wheels, and is now adapting this technology to a humanoid robot with legs. By leveraging fully autonomous driving systems and neural networks, 
transferring this technology to a humanoid form is a logical progression. The Tesla bot is designed to be user-friendly, capable of navigating environments built for humans and tackling dangerous, repetitive, or mundane tasks. Pushing AI to the forefront of technological innovation requires collaboration with industry giants like Microsoft, NVIDIA, and Google. These companies have unparalleled resources, often exceeding even those of governments. NVIDIA, for instance, has been a valuable partner, providing chips for Tesla's supercomputer system. However, Elon Musk now believes that Tesla has developed a robot brain that surpasses anything competitors can offer. For those eager to own an Optimus robot, mass production is expected to begin in 2026. The price for the robot is projected to range between $20,000 and $30,000, depending on the version. While this price may initially seem high, Musk has assured that it will decrease over time, making the Tesla bot more affordable and accessible to a broader audience in the future. So, how did Musk create such a cheap Optimus? But Optimus is made an extremely capable robot, but made in, in very high volume, probably ultimately millions of units, um, and it, it, it is expected to cost much less than a car. Bring it so, directly to the right here. Uh, I would say probably less than $20,000 would be my guess. In addition, Musk recently confirmed this on his Twitter. Complexity per unit mass is much higher with humanoid robots, but still, I think it ends up costing less than half of a car. Until now, based on Tesla's powerful resources, Elon Musk himself must admit that the price of the final version of Optimus will less over time to only $16,720. The first reason is that Tesla is autonomous in the production of powertrains, batteries, and software for Optimus. Um, the Optimus team has done an incredible job. Um, so just, yeah. Uh, the, the motors, the controllers, um, the electronics um, and, and everything you see in the Optimus robot is a Tesla designed uh, a system. So, this is. In addition, Musk confirms that Tesla produces its own powertrain. A humanoid robot, you actually have to design um, the motors and gearboxes and the, and the electronics from scratch because it's a very different application from anything else that exists. Um, so, we took our world class uh, motor and power electronics team actuators that are that don't exist in the world. Tesla said it used several innovations from its car line in the humanoid robot, including battery technology, central computers, and hardware and software security features. Konstantinos Laskaris, a motor design engineer at Tesla, describes the Optimus as having 28 actuators, compared to two actuators in a car. These actuators account for 51% of total production costs, so the cost for motion transmission is only $10,200 per robot. About Optimus's battery, the Tesla Optimus robot uses a 2.3 kilowatt hour battery pack. This battery is designed to integrate various power control systems into a single printed circuit board, which helps manage the robot's power efficiently. Scientists point out that because the cost of raw materials and increased production technology is very expensive, if Optimus's battery capacity increases by 5 kilowatt hours, it would add $50 to the cost, equivalent to 5% of the original price. Therefore, the current 2.3 kilowatt hour battery of Optimus costs only $23 per unit. Let's sit down and discuss a bit about whether the Tesla Optimus can operate all day with a 2.3 kilowatt hour battery. For example, Running a fully loaded NVIDIA 3090 for 24 hours uses about 10 kilowatt hours. Ignoring the mechanical energy and sensor costs, there's no way a multifunctional AI could work a full day on 2.3 kilowatt hours. But if we analyze it more carefully, Optimus does not have to operate for a full 24 hours with a 2.3 kilowatt hour battery. The goal is for it to run for eight hours, which is a standard work shift, not 24 hours. The robots will work on site while charging during the remaining time. Optimus uses Tesla's hardware 4, consuming around 160 watts, which means in 8 hours it uses 1.3 kilowatt hours, equivalent to 56% of the battery. Now Tesla is self-sufficient in battery power from three large factories, Gigafactory Nevada, Gigafactory Texas, and Gigafactory Berlin. 
These factories help Tesla optimize production processes, reduce costs, and create thousands of jobs for local workers. Once again, we would say that the Optimus team will achieve their goal. The second reason is that Tesla built its own artificial intelligence software for Optimus through the available full self-driving platform. Optimus is, is it's working quite well. And then for uh, full self-driving, as full self-driving gets uh, closer and closer to generalized real-world AI, that same uh, software is transferable to a humanoid robot. If you have a generalized understanding, or, or if you have generalized real-world AI, which is what we are developing for full self-driving, um, it can be transferred to basically anything. Um, and um, so, so Optimus will use the same uh, FSC computer as, as the car. Tesla suggested that the reason it's been able to move so quickly in the robotics world is that it has already laid a lot of the groundwork in its work attempting to develop automated driving for vehicles. Musk has announced that their full self-driving kit, if bought on the market, will cost $15,000. According to calculations, Musk said the cost of producing each robot is $10,000. So if Tesla cannot produce this software itself, the cost of one robot unit will increase to about $25,000, which is $5,000 higher than the announced price of $20,000 per unit. Think about it. We're just moving from wheels to our legs, explained by Milan Kovac, Tesla's director of engineering for Autopilot. So some of the components are pretty similar. It's exactly the same occupancy network. Now we'll talk a little bit more details later with the Autopilot team. The only thing that really changed is the training data. Indeed, the cost of software for an intelligent and versatile robot like Optimus is not small. For example, the most popular software currently used by most autonomous robot manufacturers is the Robot Operating System, which costs around $8,150 on the market. It's interesting to know that Optimus is saving a significant amount by utilizing the software Tesla has developed and cleverly adapting it from a wheeled system to a legged one. In addition to cost benefits, the importance of Tesla Optimus using its own software is immense. It cuts licensing and maintenance costs, allowing Tesla to use resources more efficiently. Proprietary software enables Tesla to tailor and optimize it for Optimus, ensuring top performance and adaptability. Control and security are also improved with in-house software. Tesla can implement strong security measures and maintain control over data, reducing the risk of vulnerabilities. This ensures that Optimus integrates seamlessly within Tesla's ecosystem, offering a cohesive user experience. Moreover, proprietary software gives Tesla a competitive edge. It allows for continuous innovation and sets Tesla apart from competitors relying on third-party solutions. This strategy not only strengthens Tesla's market position, but also promotes a culture of innovation and technological leadership within the company. The third reason is that Tesla takes advantage of its existing scale in the mass production of electric vehicles to apply in Optimus production. And uh, we've also designed it using the same discipline that we use in designing the car, which is to say to, to design it for manufacturing uh, such that it's possible to make the robot at, in, in high volume uh, at low cost uh, with high reliability. Tesla produces Optimus similar to their finished cars but the final model is a humanoid robot. It includes fewer parts and optimized transportability and performance for easy mass production at an affordable cost. Because of the scale and modern facilities of available manufacturing factories, Tesla Optimus can benefit greatly in terms of costs, such as reducing product prices and taking advantage of advanced technology in production. A typical example is a robot with 5% of the materials in a 2000 kilo EV having a production cost of $30,000. The material price for producing one bot is only $2,500. Tesla manufactures parts for the humanoid robot Optimus at various locations around the world. In Fremont, California, Tesla's main factory produces many crucial components for Tesla's products. In Sparks, Nevada, 
the Gigafactory produces batteries and other parts for electric vehicles and other Tesla products. In Austin, Texas, Tesla's new factory participates in manufacturing parts for Optimus. In Berlin, Germany, the Gigafactory Berlin Brandenburg also contributes to producing parts for Tesla's products. In addition, Tesla plans to expand production to other locations such as Mexico, where they will use new manufacturing techniques. Musk added that Tesla is looking for talent to research robotics and artificial intelligence. Besides that, they are also taking advantage of human resources and applying artificial intelligence technology available in Tesla's factories. With this strategy, Musk only spends $5,000 on a complete Optimus product. Are you interested in leasing or buying a Tesla product? Do you trust the functionality of such a cheap robot? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of our latest updates. Thank you for watching.